who's ready for some more suffering. Well, hopefully not. The only other potential for me to suffer in a platformer is if there's like a massive underwater stage. So, you know, water temple. So we've had clown, we've had ice. As long as it's not water, I'll, I'll be fine. <laughs> oh, this is fine. It's the desert. All right, cool. Oh. Hold on. Maybe not. <laughs> Maybe not. <laughs> this is a... There's a shipwreck. Uh-oh. But hey, brightness storm. How's it going? Oh, I may have jinxed myself. Hey, I forgot to say the usual thing I say, but you know. If you are checking this out later on YouTube, thanks for clicking the video. Yeah, look, it can't get any worse than what it did yesterday. Should I be concerned that it's giving me health that early? <laughs> what, are, what is this? Oh, I know what this is. You're at work waiting for your shift to start. Okay. Got a long one ahead or not too bad. I am doing okay. I did some Animal Crossing earlier in the morning, but then I did some video editing. So I'm pretty productive today. Just to try and get back into the swing of things before I get back to work next week. Three. Eight. Ten. Oh. <sighs> wow, this sucks. Okay. I'm gonna have to write this down. <laughs> so it's like... That's seven. Eight. Okay. Uh, okay. Oh, it doesn't repeat it? Okay, hold on. This one might take a minute. This one might take a minute. Okay. One. No, wait. Six, five, ten, three. No, nah, it's too quick. Shit. Someone write down the numbers as I read them. <laughs> Team effort! I can't write and look at the same time. I have to put the controller down as well. This is messed up because... When it comes to memory, on average, the human brain gets to like about seven and it's generally fine. This has to. This is making me remember ten. Like, seven's usually the limit for people. Okay. Um. I'm just gonna try and ride it. Fuck it. <laughs> okay. Pen and paper. Here we go. Five, ten, six, one, three, nine, two, eight, four, seven. <laughs> I await the results. But even worse is you have to smack the blocks and then rem remember. Oh boy. Okay. Five, ten, six, one, three, nine, two, eight, four, seven. Okay. 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 So that's five. This is ten. 
So this is messed up because the blocks disappear. So it makes it hard. All right, so. Five. Ten. Six. One. This is three. This would have to be nine. Two. Eight. Four. Seven. Fucking hell, man. Thank you. <laughs> Ridiculous. There's no way a child would do this. I played Donkey Kong Country 3. Like, the Simon Says game made you remember 5 at most. And it was Simon Says and the things remained. It's not like they disappeared. Thank you. That big help. It just saved us maybe 20 minutes of pain. I would have been there for 20 minutes. No, no shit. I would have. Now is not the time. Wait, so how do I... This is Mirror Mansion. There are areas here where you can advance only using the reflection in the mirrors. Use the C-stick and hang in there. Oh no. Oh no. Uh... Okay, it's not this yet. This is what it's referring to. Right, so I guess we're using the mirror to actually see where we're going. Oh, I know. I, I get what the stage is. This is like... Controls reverse the stage. <laughs> this is what they're doing. Instead of reversing your controls, they're making you look in a mirror. It's effectively the same thing. I should be okay at that. There was that Super Mario World ROM hack I played that had a stage dedicated to inverted controls. And Donkey Kong Country 3. There was also the stage there. I should be okay. God, this is making me dizzy. <laughs> Damn it. Hate that brain can't comprehend mirror images. Yeah. Sometimes it happens. It just takes some getting used to. Okay, it's fine. The Super Mario World one was, like, similar to the Donkey Kong Country one, where the moment you're in a body of water, it would invert your controls. But then you'd have to jump out of the body of water sometimes. It's not fun. I think Mega Man had something similar as well, if I remember correctly. So, I mean, this is technically a clown stage. I hope we realize this, that this is technically a clown stage. This is like a fun house. Stay gone! This is actually a clown stage. This is the sort of thing you see in a circus. Wow! 
What? Just, what do you mean? Am I supposed to punch them? The mice? No. What am I? What am I supposed to be doing? Just jumping on top? I, I tried. Good. Oh, I get it. Or maybe I don't. There's hardly anywhere to stand on now. There's also way more cray. <laughs> So way more. <laughs> Did I just mess this up from the gecko? Like, am I just supposed to? How how else am I supposed to do this? No, there has to be another way around. Can I climb? Oh, you moron. Good stuff. What the hell is this? Oh yes, all the complication. Wario loves convolution. The terrible portraits hanging on the wall will extend their hands and try to attack you. You do remember how to attack monsters who are above you, right? Well, maybe. Okay, but like, is this thing gonna... Okay, it is. I think I have to hit it again. Yeah, okay. What a weird stage. <laughs> I can't believe I'm getting like another basically a circus level. Hey, Star, how's it going? How's your day so far? Oh, no. What's this? Oh, I was one. <laughs> I was looking at chat and I jumped off the edge. Feel like a bad luck? No, it's not you. It's a hundred percent me. But if, like if someone else would have turned up and said hi right now, the same thing would have happened. It's not specific to you. I would have looked at chat, and I would have gone off the edge like a fucking idiot. So. Yeah, think of nothing of it. Uh huh. Okay. Good. 
I almost did it again. Oh, I'm probably gonna get him over here. No, it doesn't work. I think I have to throw it at the face. This game is so crazy and weird. Welcome to Wario Land games in general. That's why I like them. Okay, that doesn't work. Oh, bah. Okay, I got money. Wow. I think that's just Wario's brand at this point. Everything is strange. Okay, I need to figure out what to do. No, maybe I just have to throw it at the painting directly. Okay. Brainstorm, what will do? The only move I haven't tried is this one. Oh, okay. Well, that doesn't make sense. I would do that attack when attacking something that's in the ground, not above me. Doing a ground pound to attack what's above me? Good. Oh, come on! I hate enemies that do that. Like, you take them down and then they get the last laugh. Oh, okay. Uh, <laughs> get me out. I don't know why I'm fighting them. I don't need to. Those working mirrors, working mirrors. Wonderful. Excellent. Excellent. What did I do? What did I do? <laughs> what did I do? Excellent. Oh yeah, no, the, the mirrors do work. It's the gimmick of the stage. Is there are some sections where. You can't see Wario and you have to rely on... Really? Um, the mirror image. So, effectively you're working with inverted controls. What the fuck? Hey! Let me in! What? How am I going to get in without an enemy? Oh, this is some bullshit. Oh, this is a mirror. Okay. Yeah, it works. I don't get what I did differently that time. <laughs> I did exactly that three times. I'm 
I mean, GameCube had games with pretty nice graphics for its age. Like Metroid Prime was another good game. That for its time had pretty advanced graphics. Oh! <laughs> it didn't grab. Ugh. Alright. Grab the ledge. Okay. okay. There we go. This game just wants to make a fool of me. Yep. Pretty much. If you thought, the, if you thought this was bad, like, you should see me play Mario Sunshine. This is fine compared to that. It's okay. This so is what I do. I play games where, uh, like, a nice, chill environment and, you know, everything's okay and... Maybe I get a little creative and, you know, things are good. And then I play games that just make me scream internally and... I'll say, oh, no! I didn't say, oh, the reflection! Fuck! That! <laughs> okay, good news. I jumped back up. Wait, how does this... Oh, this is cursed. Okay, so I have to look at the reflection now. Okay, now I can look up here. Oh, I'm an idiot. Hang on. Please let me just get back up there. How did I do it before? I jumped off their heads and got up. Oh. You know what? Blessing in disguise is a button here. I missed the button. It's okay. Please. Oh no. That's gonna make me jump. Okay, so it's like. Oh wow. Okay. Dude. Okay, I got it, I got it. I need to be on the lookout because there's treasure chests as well. Oh, what have I done? Oh, no, it's fine, it's fine. Oh, that's... That's not fair. That's gonna make me do it again. Just to get that treasure chest. Wow. Okay. <laughs> no. Damn it. Hey, 
eggs! I like it when I cut him off, he just says, Eggs! But now... What do? Okay. Alright. That was easy. And I think this is the last world as well. Assuming there isn't like some grand finale world. But I can probably finish this today. I'm not sure. I haven't played this before, so we'll see. I still find it weird that in this one he's fighting wildlife primarily. Like, usually it's pirates. Hang on. Can I cheese this? Or not. Oh, yes! <laughs> right, got it. Fuck you, not doing it the normal way. Doesn't matter how badly I do now, that single move. Although... I get the feeling there's also a treasure chest. Let me have a look. Oh, there's a prison thing. Okay. Nevertheless, it's still... Oh no. Rough. Yeah, okay, there's a treasure chest here as well. Like, I don't have to go to all the way to the end. Boy, what is this? Oh no. Oh no! Okay, uh... I have to get to the middle. Oh! <laughs> oh no! Go this way. This way's better. Come on! <laughs> Do I- I have to go all the way around, don't I? Okay. I thought I could just jump to it, but I don't think you can. Just chill here. Yeah, it has... ...platform in the middle. Why would- Why would I go over there? I don't know why I went that way. There is zero benefit to going where that big ball is. Okay, and now it's just white. I don't care about the coins. But 
This is just gonna go. Whoops, 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 whoops. That's just gonna go there, so I don't have to follow that. There's probably a button at the end of this passageway. A button though. Another mirror. I mean, I can die and take hits all I want as long as I don't take like two hours to finish the stage. Everything's fine. That's all. That's. That's all I need to just beat. Yeah, that's a better camera angle. I have no idea what this is doing there. What is this altering? Oh. You might find areas that appear to be dead ends up ahead, but search around. You may not be able to see the way out first, but there should be hints reflected in the mirror. I can't look above me. Okay, I see, I see. I saw what it was. I got everything. Oh, I see what it, I see what it means. There's and it, there's ghosts. What? I can't attack them. Oh, I hate this. Wait a second. No. Get up, 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 get up. Get up. At this point, I, I'm just gonna lose coins when I'm down here. That's just. There's just no way to stay on balance. Please tell me. No. Oh, uh, wait. Am I ahead or behind? Nope, I'm behind. I didn't make it through the gate. Wait a minute. No, it's so close. Warrior, <laughs> please. Oh, garlic, please. I didn't find the blue button for that other chest, though. Uh, this is problematic. I may have to backtrack. 
It's not too late. I can go back. But see, if I drop down there, that's a point on the return, so I should probably check. As much as I don't want to, it'd be way worse to have to just repeat the rest of the stage again. So far, I've found everything, so... in the mirror. There's probably a button in the mirror or something. Ah, oh, there it is. Oh, wow. Okay. There's still a lot. Invisible wall. What's this? Oh! I have no one to blame but myself for that one. That one, yeah. That should not have happened. Okay. But everything is accounted for so far. Doesn't matter if, like, I look like an idiot. As long as the stage gets completed fully the first time around, then I'm okay. Besides, uh, I'm here to entertain, aren't I? Is that not why you're here? I'm okay, I promise. Hey, streamer, make the funny sound when you get angry. Sound like you're about to die on the inside. Content? Yeah, I guess. <laughs> Who knows, maybe if I get the final dead at all. Like, highlight video of this playthrough since it's a short one. Wait, where was the light blue chest again? I hit the button. I missed it, didn't I? I did. I think I know where I missed it. It's over here. Oh, gee. It was the thing making a loud sound the whole time, and I just ignored it. Okay. But otherwise, everything is good so far. to go up here. Okay, now we can continue. Wonderful. 
Ooh, that is some expensive garlic. I'll just take one. Oh, what fresh hell is this? Uh-oh. It's hard to tell which way is forward. So now once I'm done with this game, there's one more Wario game that I haven't played. And that's... There's one on the DS that I haven't played. I do own. Oh, this is rude. Is this one harder than the first one? Oh, this is definitely harder than the first one. The first one did not do this. Okay, I'm not imagining it. No! Oh! I hope I'm not graded by how much money I earn. Ultimately, oh, that sucks. Ah, oh, it cancels out the attack if I land on it. See what's over here. What is this? What? Okay. I think I should go back. This seems like it's going forward. Oh, I see what it's going to do. What? Hey, I needed that. Why are they disappearing? like this now, is it? Whee! Yeah, that camera angle does not work. Okay. It has to be this way. Nope, that's bad. <laughs> Look how far away it is. I need to know. Oh, yeah, I'm headed that way. Okay. Ah. 
Oh, all right. Getting there. Let go. Oh, almost bricked it. With this one, I feel like I can't go flying. If I go flying, I'm gonna... Nope, I have to go flying. I guess I just have to control. I'm getting the hang of it. But hey, okay, that, there we go. This is the way. Get ah. back! <laughs> oh no! I knew that would happen. Do I have to do it? Some oh, whatever. Silver lining is I'm replenishing my coins. Oh, this is annoying. Do I have to ground pound maybe? I think I might have to ground pound to stop my my speed. statue pieces. That one at least was fun. Oh, here it is. Can I climb back up? Okay, the answer is no. Oh man. Okay, but how do I go back? Has to be a way to go back to the other part. The main MC inside the goal is a coward. Even if you bang on the cup he's hiding in, he won't come out. But hey, don't give up. He's definitely hiding in that cup. Oh, what fresh hell is this? <laughs> I 
have one more treasure to find. How do I get back up? I don't want I don't want to have to go through the whole stage again just to get back up. Is there really no other way? I think I have to do that. Okay, I think that's that's the jump I have to do. Careful! It's the cast. Oh, I'm overcomplicating it. Okay. I don't have to go sideways, it's just straight across. There we go. Okay. We're good. Alright, cool. No backtracking. Um, I'm gonna buy more garlic. Nice and healthy. Okay, so the advice was no matter what, it's in the cup, I think it's in. That is frightening. What's going on? So. Oh, is that it? <laughs> I mean, that's pretty funny if you don't choose to smack it. This is gonna be the easiest boss yet. Oh! Provided I don't fuck it up. I may have overdone that a little there. <laughs> stuck. Okay, 
Okay, now now he's not messing around. This is tippy to animation. You're not fooling me. Get in your cup. GG. <laughs> that makes up for the clowning around. <laughs> no problems here. I love how they've given Wario's belly physics in this game. <laughs> it's ahead of its time. Please don't let this be an underwater stage. What's it called? I'm a number one. It doesn't say the name. Okay. It's a desert level, this is fine. Okay, I need to bring an enemy. I imagine this thing. Yeah, the sand level, it's fine. I don't mind desert levels. Oh, what? No, why is it doing this again? That was like smack bang in the middle. Is that a sh- <laughs> No! <laughs> I got distracted. <laughs> it's a shovel. I thought it was a stingray again, but it's a shovel. Wow, literally the last one. Going to be the last one. Where is it? Oh, wait, what? Did I? <laughs> I got past it and not see. Oh, fell down again. I was just afraid of what those things were going to do to me. Hey. Uh oh. I'm already throwing it. Let me in. There we go. Uh. 
doesn't seem so bad. the exit. I don't want the exit. Is there anything? What do you think the odds are there's something down here? I mean, what have I got to lose, really? I don't die. It worked. I mean, that doesn't. I don't think this was, this was the way I was supposed to do it. It's okay. But it's still rescued. I don't have to repeat it, so it's fine. So just do this and I'm done. Easy. Okay. Like, you know. Wait, did I fall off? Oh, it only goes halfway. But it went. Right, whatever. What did I do? Wait, what did I do last time? Oh, no, I got it, I got it, I got it. I'm, I'm a dummy. Each one rises it a bit higher. There we go. Now it should reach the top. Okay, this should work now. Matter. Okay. It looks like this area revolves around the pyramid. Like, goes around in a circle. Goal. Serious for a sec. This level's pretty cool so far. I'm not following a set path, you just go around the whole thing. It feels more like a Mario stage. Like you're exploring an area. Oh, 
really? If they didn't have that shovel on the end, it would look rather phallic. <laughs> Movement cubes? I think I've bricked it by doing that. Hang on. Reset it. Ugh. Alright. Oh, I gotta... Do I have to grab the thing again? No, it's fine. Okay. Hold on. This is a puzzle, so... How does this work? I can't... I can't hit it from underneath. Somehow made it go up. Hang on. Do it again. Reaction. And how do I make this work in my favor? Oh, <laughs> damn it! But, like, no, but can I grab? Okay, I can grab. We're fine. The stone cold statue in front of the ladder is made up of three blocks that contain eyes, nose, mouth, and a weak spot. The strides strike its weak spot and topple all the blocks. Well, that was an interesting puzzle. Okay, now there is actually an abyss in the stage. Okay. Uh -oh. 
These palm trees in the background are in the way. I can't tell. Oh no, what am I doing? Okay, good. Good job. That miss. over there, though. Yeah. <laughs> what do you think the odds that this is going to work? Oh, no. Zero. <laughs> That's a wall there. Really? Doesn't look like this is quicksand, so. It doesn't really move you either. I'm not really sure why it's. Ah. There's no danger here. <laughs> it just looks like it's bad, but it's not. Oh. There this time. Really, the way up? Yes. I wonder how bad it is if I write it down. Oh, no. Excuse me for thinking there's a secret. This was Super Mario Bros. 3, there would be totally a secret down there. The classic, like, ride the quicksand to the bottom where you think you're gonna die and then there's a secret.
Okay, I guess this kind of worked out. I could find something new. Oh, it's this again. This puzzle is so bizarre. Don't think there's any way to fix this now. Yeah, okay. Once it ends up there, that's it. I need to think about this. I think this is correct, and then let's do that. on the edge if I do that. Punch it inwards. I'll stop grabbing the ledge, just punch it. There we go. Okay, so now. <laughs> oh shit. Okay. But I have no way to go. Gotta be something like that. No! Ah! <laughs> this is gonna be something very specific. Uh, okay, hang on. Let's 
has to involve a galaxy brain. something like this. I just need to get it to come back out somehow. This is just weird block physics that I'm not sure. I mean, okay. I would imagine the first move has to be this. that. Nope. Okay. I'm gonna take it one step at a time. If I get it stuck in a corner, then it's incorrect. Okay, so this is the first move. Second move. Third move. Fourth move. Okay, 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 okay. <laughs> what good is this? Introduce one more into the equation, or what's that gonna do? Oh, good. <laughs> Can't I just punch? made this so much worse. Well, I can't fix this now. Alright, I gotta leave. I bet the answer to this is very simple and I'm just overcomplicating it. This is one of these things where it's just... You can probably do it in two moves, I'm just making it harder than it needs to be. Alright, hang on, can't I just... Okay, 
Okay. it i needed to grab the ledge and then it would come back and i'd ride it and jump off i think it's bricked now Try this again. I don't see the point of that move, but if I do this, if I play my cards right here. Copy that. Ooh, this puzzle's annoying. to stop it, but... Like, they're not gonna come out from here. <laughs> gonna die. Yeah. What if I... Let's see what kind of effect this has if I were to. Oh, I just sent it to the moon. I don't think sending it to the moon was the right call. Yeah, okay, this is this is gone.
this is not easy. Alright, so I mean, doing that is not a good idea. Can't really achieve anything. Just seeing what each effect does. There has to be a simple answer for this. end up in a situation where the block is moving through the middle somehow. This is going to be a headache, isn't it? I mean, eventually I have to get this right. I think. I keep, uh, keep ending up with the same thing. Hang on. I know what I must end up with, it's just, I guess I have to play this smart. out what I do once I get it to here. This is, this is less than the clown stage now. my moves very carefully. Comes the same problem. <laughs> Any one I 
looks like a crack. I mean, just tell me where to punch it. I'll punch it. I feel like I'm on the right track. I just need to make it work like... There's one, a way to get one in the middle, can I punch one into the other while it's moving to make him stop? I was trying to do that, but I think it's, it's this. You make one hit, and line up the next one, and it just gets, the circle gets smaller and smaller. I think this is it. I think I got it now. And then... Ha <laughs> ha! Got it. Yeah, yeah. There we go. Hey, Slayer. Thank you for the raid. It just happened as I got it. Oh, man. How long was I there? I was there for like 10 minutes, surely. <laughs> Wait, but like... Oh, cool. Whoa. That's neat. This... Wait, but can I... Okay, I can climb. There we go. I mean, that was... Oh. Oh, no, it's another one. Let's <laughs> do another one. It goes without saying that the laser used by the laser jiggle fish is dangerous. Try circling it, then drop from above. Oh, no. oh, I, have to, I, have to, I have to do another one. Okay. Oh! <laughs> Never mind. Never mind. It's not a puzzle. It's just reflexes. Get out of the way. Oh. Surely I can do this. Alright, that one was actually easy. There were coins at the top, but who cares? I'm good for coins. <laughs> Damn it. Hey, there we go. Don't take damage. Oh, garlic, please, yes. Wonderful. Hang on, like... Oh. These are things the game was referring to. Wee. 
No, you can't. You can't. Okay. His seven to six year old friend got out of hospital and you got his belated Christmas presents and then he was happy. Oh, nice. I mean, bad that they're in the hospital, but belated Christmas presents. Always good. Come here. Please work. This is usually very... Okay, good. Oh, what is this? Is this... That's fine. Oh, if this was Mario Sunshine, I would have died a long time ago. No. That's the one thing I'll give this game credit for. You don't just slide off up randomly. It is very lenient. Damn it. I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm fine! No, no. My follow goal? <laughs> yeah, it's not a real goal. It's funny though. I forget that I did that. I was like, I wonder how much I can make it. Wait, what is this? How do I... What? What, what? what do I go from here? What? What happens when I reach the end? There's like a massive... What? I'll... No, I'm fine. Oh, this is horrible. Oh. Mario does not have this much trouble jumping. Are you kidding? <laughs> Go play Mario Sunshine, get back to me. The moment Mario goes on even an at the slightest of angles, he slips. Ugh. Wario, at least, has some traction. Man, in Mario Sunshine, I would just die to just things that I should not die to. <laughs> At least this lets you try again, and it doesn't count as a death, so it's pretty lenient. Okay. I should probably slow down. That might be why I'm bailing this. Uh, but wh what do I do here? What? The gap is so massive. Unless it's getting closer, I'm not realizing it. I may have to rotate the camera. No, but see, that's not gonna help right now. Okay, slow down. Can I have the puzzle back, please? I'd rather be stuck in a puzzle. Good! Oh, yep, good. Okay, it's fine.
Give me a minute. Give me a minute. So, what's the go? Oh, it does. Oh, that is horrible. Oh, that is horrible. Oh, wow. This one, this one is cursed. Good. Funny sound now, huh? You make the audience question your sanity, huh? Warrior, oh, yeah, please. The worst part about this now is I'm on half a heart. If I take a hit, I'm gone. This now's making me clench on two different levels. Are you please? Ah, oh, come on. This is this is horrible. Finesse required for this? Oh no, that I've made a terrible choice here. Okay, that's fine. Oh, is this the move? Is this the move? Is this the move? Breathe again. Wonderful. 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 
I don't know how I did that without taking damage there. Yeah. That has to be the single hardest thing I've had to do in this game. I don't count the ice level because that's just a collection of pain. But the amount of platforming prowess I just had to exhibit. Almost lost it a couple times there too. I was. I mean, this may be the last stage. If there is no world after this, then it, it makes sense why it would have something that difficult for right now. What? What is this? Oh, no. No. Let go! Oh, I see. Good work. All right, I'm like just over halfway. Oh no. Okay, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. It is lenient. It is not like the ice level. That thing reminded me of, um, it's like this game show I used to watch as a kid. And the big thing was they used just very cheesy computer graphics to morph faces. And there was one there was one round where you would have to take like fake lips and stuff and place them on celebrities. And they looked exactly like that. And the people that messed up would end up with just three lips. That was the big rage, just... Hey, we can make one image transform into another image. Let's make a whole game show about that. Oh. Back when we didn't know what to do with new technology, yeah. But I mean, I feel like we still don't know what to do with new technology. I saw someone generating security footage of people being arrested because they have giant feet. With AI, so... Have we really... Really changed much? The iron cider at the goal up ahead spins around while spewing flames. When flames close in, look for some sand. Use the ground pound. Around the ground. I mean, you know one thing I learnt recently from my younger cousins? I mean, they're very young. They're like, one's under the age of ten. But, you know, what a skibbity toilet is. I mean, I get it. It's like, it's fine. It's another lol random thing. But it's literally a head coming out of a toilet. And making noises. So I'm okay with, you know, feeling old and not connecting with the youth. I think I'm good. I laughed at stupid shit back in the day. It's okay. Oh, no. 
I'm sure I, I was into things that my cousins and uncles were like, this kid's crazy. Just, I'm so glad I have nothing to do with his generation. Is it a specific head or just any head? Um, it started off as a specific head and now it's just... There's so many of them. I mean, if you're morbidly curious, you can look it up. But I take no responsibility as to what side effect it might have on your psyche. I don't know if you want to fuck your algorithm like that. Yeah, I know what you mean. I played a dating sim once, um, where it was Gordon Ramsay and Paula Dean, and now my Steam recommendations, no matter what the fuck I do, every now and then will say, "Hey, here's an here's an anime dating game where like the main character shows their tits within the first three seconds." Since you know, you're into Gordon Ramsay and Paula Dean fucking. Here's a game of an orc running a massage parlor. I'm not making it up, like, this is actual recommendations. I bet if I go now, it'll recommend. If I go through my coming up next, you know, the. the queue. It'll recommend at least one of those games to me. So I've, I've permanently fucked my Steam recommendations. Because for Valentine's Day in 2022, I just decided to play a bunch of dating sim games. And some of them were weird. So I don't blame you if you don't want to look up a video of a, a head coming out of a toilet. I get it. Where did I even find the Gordon Ramsay one? I mean, there's like an engine where you can make your own dating sims, and you'd be surprised at the different kind of ones there are. If you're morbidly curious about that stream, <laughs> there's a clip on the channel under moments. If you look at my moments on the stream, there's a clip there. I don't know if moments, if they've removed moments yet. They said they were gone, but they might still be there. Otherwise, on the VOD's channel, there's like a Valentine's Day stream under my weird section. Like morbidly curious. Oh, I see what I need to do. Something like that. I tried to do my best Gordon Ramsay impersonation, so you know, not to brag, but... I'd say I made it sound like Gordon Ramsay wanted to... <laughs> I'm sorry, I can't finish that sentence. Authentic version of Gordon wanting to just, um... churn the butter, if you know what I mean. I was gonna say something way worse. I won't say it. Then you, you'll question my sanity, I don't know. It'll also spoil the, uh, the top moment <laughs> a little bit, like the culmination of me playing that dating sim. Man, I think the worst thing I linked people, not as a teenager, maybe, I want to say in my 20s, but you know, the video of um, that lady and the grapefruit technique. 
I, I, yeah, ruined a bunch of people with that one. Get out of here! Just the lady that sounded like she was opening the gates of hell by sucking a dick. Well, I guess she wasn't actually sucking a dick, she was just, like, pretending to. Okay. Hope she's doing okay. I bet she's probably doing fine. Probably got a little bit of fame from that, I would hope. Got <laughs> sign-ups to her class. Oh uh, dear. Yeah. I don't know, man. I, I just I think the sound of having a grapefruit on my junk doesn't sound very appealing. But I guess I wouldn't know that it's happening, because she did say you gotta put the blindfold on. And I feel like you would know. Like, hang on, what is this? <laughs> What's going on here? Why do I smell citrus all of a sudden? Well, it's citrus as well, like... I don't know. I feel like your, your skin would tingle at the very least. I don't know. She just made it sound so normal, like, yeah, no big deal. I haven't played dating sims since. That was like a once-off thing, I haven't... I didn't make it an annual tradition. She specified in the video to have it cut already because pulling out a knife in bed would make a partner running it run away. Yeah. But it just seems like something out of a TV show, like just I forgot what TV show it was, but there was something similar where, like, this guy was saying he swore that you need to have, like, a fisherman's friend or something. Like, a mint. Something very similar, but for girls, you know? The other way around. It's like, yeah, have a mint beforehand. And there was one of those things where the dudes believed him and it, it ended up being wrong. I don't know. I feel like it's either from osmosis that I, I heard that or like from TV. That's the thing. I've just seen so much shit over the years on the internet that it's just completely ruined me as a person. So I can't really pinpoint where certain things come from anymore. It feels like I think you should leave, but maybe it is. Hey. 
or like, you know, Nathan Fielder just has a new TV show where he just tries to convince people to do like a weird sexual act. He would totally do something like that, just make a fake celebrity that teaches people things. And then one of those things is just, you know, how to be better at sex and just makes them do weird shit like stick a grapefruit on someone's dick. Sounds like great TV. Well, if you haven't seen any of Nathan Fielder's shows, I highly recommend them. Um, particularly the new one. The new one is amazing. I'm looking forward to the next season of it. Like, uh, it's called The Rehearsal. But also, his older one, Nathan For You, it's, it's really good too. I think the best thing about it is just the guy, he has the most dry sense of humor and voice, just so monotone, and man, he's so good at that. Confirm, he <laughs> came out of lurking to talk about, like, that experience you had with the website and the, the non-holy things. Damn it. You saw clips of him getting people to camp in the mountains for free gas. Yeah, that's Nathan for you. That episode, the premise of it is he was, he was trying to do marketing for a gas station, and so they had a rebate thing. And it's pretty much just proving the extent people will go to just to save a few cents. A lot of his stuff is social experiment. Definitely check out the series. The rehearsal is just brilliant. The premise of that one is like... Early on, it's just a thing where... He lets people practice... A life event, so... You know, he goes to this dude who... He's worried about a conversation he's about to have with someone. Like, he's gonna meet up with an old friend he hasn't seen in a while. And he's going to admit to them that you know, the first time they met, he said that he was a college graduate and he wasn't. And so he's stressing out about this. So the premise is Nathan sets up basically like Hollywood level movie set where he can go into a physical replica of the bar he's gonna meet this person in and rehearse his like, you know, admission of guilt. And of course, you know, Nathan preys on just the paranoia and just the absurdity. So he makes him go through just the worst case scenarios and the worst case scenarios would never happen. Like realistically, the way the conversation will go is just, oh, really? Okay. And that's the end of the conversation. But this dude is just like stressing out over it. Like very extremely neurotic. And so, yeah, that's the premise of the show is like he gets people like that and he just Enables them. <laughs> and yeah, there's some there's some really scary ones. There's another one where like this lady wants to practice what it would be like to have a kid. And it sounds innocent enough until like slowly but surely you realize, oh man, no, this this lady should never have children. Anyway, check it out. It's worth it. It's a good watch. It's not very long, but there are, there are apparently more episodes on the way. Oh, no! Oh! <laughs> Cow. What is with these sub-stages? I'm so lost now, I don't know where I am. Where am I? 
Oh. Okay. <laughs> nice save. Well, do that. I ultimately fucked it up anyway. I hear the, the little dude banging on the cage nearby. I haven't seen him though. Is this spelling something? I, this is clearly a question mark. It's just a coin, right? It's a coin. Okay, don't worry about that. Ow! <laughs> oh my god, what is this? Holy crap! Look at this. I just... It kind of dawned on me how big this was. I guess when you're too busy talking about just... Grapefruits and grapefruit adjacent things. You don't really realize what you're up against. I can hear it, but I don't see it. I would see it if it was anywhere near near me. It's just, it's, it's in my headphones, it's in my ear, and it feels like it's close by, but it doesn't look like it is. Wow, this is, this is so horrible. Is there no easy... Last couple have definitely felt like there's something out of Mario Sunshine. Look at the size of this map! Okay, that is a dead end. Go back. No, 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 no. What do you mean down? Fuck off, what do you mean down? 
this can't be right. This no, this can't be right. No, what or what is this? What? Okay, look around, look around. Fuck is the stage? Oh, I hate, I hate this. Oh. <laughs> I'm okay. I'm okay. Watch this, Lise. You can pinpoint the heart moment. Moment is heart splits in two. I don't, couldn't even say the right thing. You can pinpoint the moment his heart splits in two. Oh, fuck off. This is unbelievable. <laughs> this is like the size of the stage that I'm trying to do outside of this. Worst part is this whole time in my ear, it's just this thing going. Go, 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 go. I'm, I'm losing my mind. Oh, no. Analog stick, don't use a... This is why there's health there. Alright, now from here, where am I going? I have to do a leap of faith here. I should have put a timer on this. Shut up, confirm me. <laughs> Don't mess with my emotions right now. I don't want to have to imagine a reality where like things are worse than what they are. Oh yeah, they should have put a timer on it. And then the GameCube, right? It should have had this thing that electrocutes the player if the timer hits zero. Fuck! Okay, I'm fine. No, I'm not. It's uh, I'm at the start. I'm at the start! Ugh. <laughs> uh. Oh, no. 
I can only imagine what it would have been like if there was a timer on this. If this was Mario Sunshine, there would have been a timer on it. Because a lot of those stages famously did. What's that one quote about being stuck and trying a new strategy? I mean, the definition of insanity is trying the same thing and expecting a different result. But I haven't been trying the same thing. Like, that was a different path I went up that time. <laughs> it's, just, it's just this long and tedious. From that one game that was a weird dating sim. What? Oh, right. I know what you're talking about. Remember, if you get stuck, you can undo. And it would just say that like 10 times. Every step you would take. Remember? You got stock, you can undo. Okay. I had dreams about that game. Just the tower climb. I have a complicated it. It's just simple. I think I might finally be able to get this ringing out of my ear. Okay, just. I'm the last Sprite Link. Prisoner, there are 40 of us all together. How many did you say? Okay. This makes us better now, because now... Okay, but see, now... Wow, this is actually horrible. <laughs> There's no way to get there without dropping from above, and now I have to just do all this again. Better be nothing worth like surely this is the pinnacle of difficulty for this game. time in that game. Edge. 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 You don't know what I'm talking about. I, I played Catherine full body in just that game. It's like a dating sim with platforming that kind of reminiscent of this. So I need to go this way. I think I'm almost there. Oh, I almost bricked it. Okay. Ugh. 
Okay. Get me out of here. Oh. I thought for a second you were censoring Catherine, but then I remembered why it does. Catherine is because there's Catherine with a C, with a K, and with a. with an X. Man, the stage has been something else. I thought this was going to be very straightforward. Just going around in a circle. I was like, oh, this stage is enclosed. It seems fine. It actually didn't seem so bad on paper. It's had two of the most nightmarish things I've had to do in this game so far. chest. Uh. GameCube! What's missing? There's one more treasure missing and one more golden thing missing. Oh, there's a treasure over there. Okay, so now I just need one more golden thingy. know where this would be. What in the fuck is this game? What do you mean? What's wrong? What made you say that all of a sudden? That other stuff didn't. <laughs> None of this makes sense. Have you ever played warrior games before? Confirm me, in the second warrior game I ever played, he owned a pet chicken that had tits, and then that chicken did not appear in another game again. It wasn't like a beloved character, it just, yep, has a chicken that has tits. WarioWare makes just about as much sense as this game does, pretty much. Honestly, the brand for Wario games is just weird. It always has been. Nothing is ever normal. Well, I'm missing one golden thingy. I don't know where it is. Warrior gets all the rejected Mario game pitches? I don't think so. For a, wh for a while. Particularly on the Game Boy. 
They stopped making Mario games on the Game Boy to make Wario games because they were more successful. I mean, maybe after that in the 3D era, sure. I still stand by my opinion that... It's been long enough, we need another one of these games. The last one was for the Wii. One more item away. The thing that I'm worried about is like... Ooh. Ooh. Chat. Um. Question. Was anyone paying attention to that like... Stage that I was suffering in? You know, the big one. I don't think I collected a golden thing, a golden part from that. But that might be where it is. I'm gonna have a look outside. I'm gonna have a look outside first before I resort to entering that monstrosity of a level again, but... I get the feeling I may have to enter the monstrosity of a level again. The stage I'm struggling in gonna have to be more specific. <laughs> the one in the the one in the sky. Alright, yeah, all right. I walked into that one. Ah, uh, <laughs> I forgot about this. <laughs> Why did you do that? Why does this only sometimes work? I might have to look it up. Not the rotating platform and the spiky ball, but the one with um, the sky stage. Where it took like 15, 20 minutes <laughs> platforming. I'll have a look around out here first, but... Yeah, I mean, I'm all for looking up where this final one is. The good thing about this is you can just look up which body part is missing from the statue and then we'll know which one it is. Oh. It's glowing, so this... Yep, this has to be it. Yeah, this is brand new. Okay. What? What? Oh my god. Okay. What? What do you mean? The first one, okay, I get it, but like, what? What? What, what the? What? <laughs> what?
Am I, am I that tired or uh, am I missing the obvious here? What? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? What are you? What? What am? What am I missing here? What? What is? Oh my god! Okay, I got it. I got it. I got it. Oh, this is this is fucking. This is horrendous. Okay, I get it. Oh. Wow. Okay. All right. No. All right. Okay. Oh. One health to the next, huh? It just doesn't reliably grab the ledge. I think GameCube games not caring about your feelings is unique to GameCube games. Like, man, this was a thing with Nintendo 64, Super Nintendo, NES, Game Boy. Just let's say anything before the year 2010 just had zero fucks about how you felt. <laughs> okay, we're done. Best menu music ever. Alright, let's get to the end. Somehow the desert stage has ended up being harder. You're gonna miss the end because you have to go do actual work or crap timing. <laughs> well, unless the final boss is suffering, you've probably seen the best part already, which is just me losing my fucking mind for like an hour. But, have fun with work. <laughs> how how could this possibly get any more difficult than what I've had to go through already? Oh. Okay, thanks for huh? Oh you ass hat. This is it. No! No! <laughs> Garlic bliss. Okay. 
All right, we're here. I wonder what mind-altering drugs I'm playing this game would do to me. I don't want to find out. Hey, to Mr. Struggle, have a good night. No worries, Brightness Storm. Thanks for hanging out. Hope you enjoyed. You can always watch the VOD later. See how it ends. This sounds very Last Boss-like. Oh, this is... It's a hands boss? This is like Mario 64. Okay, oh, this is fine. I've already done two points of damage to it. There wouldn't be a game in the Mario, uni Mario universe without one of these bosses. but it just collided with me as it finished. Oh, dude, that was easy. Given what I just went through for the last hour, that, that was fine. Now the question is, is there a final world, or is it just... We're up to the, the big finale now. Beautiful! Beautiful! <laughs> Oops. I love that laugh, though. Captain Skull's Showdown. Oh, that's quite the abyss. Hmm. Okay. How does this work? Oh! What? Oh! Dude, this feels like a Smash Brothers stage. Oh, okay. Alright, I got it. You have to... You have to where he, he is. Didn't do any damage. Oh, yes, it did. This, uh, this seems rather anticlimactic. Oh, wow. 
what have I done? I have to stomp. I'm not sure how to do damage to it right now. I haven't been able to do damage to it. That didn't work either. Let me watch it for a minute. It's gotta be an easy answer to this. I thought it, would, it might be like the ball fight, where you have to bait it. What is this? I don't know what to do. Okay, cool. Invulnerable, but why? It's not a height thing. I don't get this, man. What the hell? Everything was going fine, like, what is this phase? There has to be a simple answer to this. Let's try something else. I'm getting on the opposite side. The only thing I can think of is, like, maybe... throw something across to him like this. This is really the case, it's kind of annoying. Hang on. It's definitely not attacking him anymore directly, like I think it has to be a ranged attack. Oh, that's what it is. All right, there we go. Don't get up. Oh. One more, one more, one more. Oh, 
Oh shit. Alright, I got it. You want me to die? No! Oh, I fucked up. Damn it. Let's try and go quicker. Hang on, wait. Oh, get lost. <laughs> My god. Okay. Have to trust that it was gonna hit. There we go, we got him. I don't get any coins for this. Now the big question, is there another world or is it just one more fight? <laughs> Man, <laughs> that last stage is something else. Okay. Here we go. Wait, why is there one question mark here? Just a sec. Oh no. There's a treasure missing in the in the forest. Excitement Central Greenhorn Forest. What? Did I miss it? Where? This? Oh, oh, please don't let it be. Please don't let it be this one. That's not this one. <laughs> Thank you. Wait, which stage is it? It's not here. Oh, this is three. It's one. Door number one. This two. Just one. It has to be here. Okay. Somehow in the first stage, we'll, we'll be fine. We'll be fine. We'll be fine. We'll be fine. There's not going to be any suffering here. I just have to find it. Which... Okay, according to this, it's the last treasure, which means it's probably better to go to the end and then come back. Somewhere here there's a treasure that I missed. Shouldn't be difficult, like the stage was straightforward. 
back in a time where I was first playing this game and nothing was tricky at all. Wait a minute, this is... Oh. Alright, I'm kind of confused as to where I am right now. Maybe it doesn't take it to the end? There's no way that's the end. Like that's... It's, like, it's all well, I'll go from here. We'll find it. Yeah, this is definitely not anywhere close to the end. Okay, so this is the end. So somewhere here I've missed something. in the buttons here, so what gives? It's not panic yet. There has to be a reasonable explanation for this. What if it's a chest that I opened and I could see... According to the level, it should be the last treasure, but I looked at the last treasures. Not there. It has to be near the end. It has to be near the end. It, it cannot be further back. Otherwise, I'll just look it up. I don't want a headache. The answer has to be simple. Is this a thing? No, that's just a pit. Oh, wow. Simpler times. back to the start. <laughs> the 
weird thing is it's it's a button and the treasure chest. So I don't understand how that's a thing. Okay, hang on. Mario World Greenhorn Forest Treasures. Give me a sec. Okay, I got a picture of it. No, that's not what we want. We want. Wait, on a wooden platform at the top of the climbable tree at the beginning of the level? What? Why is treasure right at the beginning of the level? Oh, that is some bullshit. Really? What? Oh, now I'm glad I looked this up. I am definitely glad I looked that up. Okay, now we are actually good. So, the question is, is this a final world or not? Am I sacrificing the sprites? Hurry up. 
why has fire not gone down? Oh, yeah. Okay, health is, health is even now. was bad. I got this done without having a game. around. Wait, that didn't count. Oh, that didn't count as damage. Oh, now I have to be careful. Uh -oh. 
having to play jump rope with this. I'm, not, I'm gonna have just under 10,000 coins now, and I get the feeling that 10,000 is like a good score. All because I didn't hold it in for like another half second. Unless there's a phase two. I win. I win. <laughs> no phase two. <laughs> okay, I think we're done. Maybe. Hey, Colrin, how's it going? You did it! You defeated all the evil monsters. Everything will be alright now. Wario, we're saved. Thank you. The evil black jewel has been smashed to powder. The monsters won't come back now, but even if they do, I think we can handle them. As a reward, we're going to rebuild your ruined castle. We Spritelings aren't that strong, so without a lot of us, I doubt we can re rebuild your castle, but we'll do our best with what we have. I got them all. Here goes. I got them all, so they're gonna do a good job. Almost Friday? Oh yeah, right. <laughs> oh, okay. They're like Korok, so they're gonna do a little dance and then... A castle will materialize. Yeah, ha ha. There's my thumbnail. <laughs> oh, you don't get to see it? I guess you get to see it at the end. Beatboxing end credits, really? Do you reckon this is Charles Martinet doing the beatboxing? mental picture of Charles trying to beatbox. Well, this game, I think, is a treat. A lot of fun. Really enjoyed it. Just surprised a lot of people haven't heard of it, but I guess it's on the GameCube and... The GameCube is one of the less, uh, I wouldn't say less known, but it didn't do as well as the other consoles. Not Wii U bad, but, you know, not as successful as the Wii or the Switch. But, um, this was one of the games I just never got to experience because did not have the GameCube, so cool to check it out. I got one more Wario game to check out, and then I've actually played all of them, so... I'll be neat. But, yeah, I mean... When I compare this to my first playthrough of Mario Sunshine, I honestly had a lot more fun with this one. This one... I think Sunshine's biggest downfall was actually the platforming. Whereas in with this... There were difficult sections for sure, but I didn't really feel robbed of it, But if that makes sense. Like, Sunshine, there were so many circumstances where... Either flood felt janky, the camera angle didn't work, or you would just randomly slip off things. Just the amount of times you slip off things in Mario Sunshine is, is insane. Whereas in this, Wario had proper traction on slopes, and it was great. Um, and it's a weird game. I love weird. So it's cool. Definitely, definitely a really good game in my book. 
Yeah. So, if you haven't played this yourself, give it a go. It's a lot of fun. I don't know if it'll ever come to Nintendo's online service, but you never know. Hey, Wario World Remake. There it is. That's it. That's the stuff. Now, that's the kind of place a guy like me deserves. Yeah, so. Like classic. If you get everything, he gets the best castle. Yeah. Oh, it reset the game. <laughs> that slide's showing the resolution change. That's it. Hundo percent. Alright, well, that was my playthrough of Wario World. Hope you enjoy it, everyone. Uh, yeah, and of course, if you are watching this later on YouTube, thank you for sticking it out with me on this one. Hope you enjoyed as well. I'll check out the other Wario game that I haven't played is The Master of Disguise on the DS. I do have a copy of it, so I'll probably check it out sometime soon. But for now, if you enjoyed the playthrough and want to support the channel over there, the easiest way to do so is just click the like button, or you can also watch me play other things by clicking one of the videos that pop up. It helps out the channel a lot either way, so really do appreciate those that do that. So, yeah. We'll uh, catch Warrior next time <laughs> on whatever game I play next. Alright, bye YouTube.